What's up, you guys? It's a beautiful Saturday morning. I'm on my way to work. Day number thir thir 12, 13. Day number 13 in a row. So I thought I'd make a truck vlog. Haven't, uh, haven't made one in a while. Man, those... Dude, those cars are wrapped all the way around that block. That's crazy. I got some requests for more truck vlogs. Apparently, uh, a lot of people are kind of liking those. So uh, let's keep them going, yeah? All right, when I was trying to drive past these people that are doing stupid shit. All right, take two. I lived in Mammoth for a while after I graduated high school. Moved down to Orange County, did some stupid things down there. I uh, had some fun and uh, moved back up here to Lake Isabella where I met my late wife, Wendy. She lived in Ridgecrest at the time. So we met, hooked up, moved in together, and a couple months after that, we moved up to Mammoth. Um, we moved a couple places around up there. Uh, we were in one place and a uh, real nice two-story house. I think it was like three or four bedroom. We had a roommate that ended up moving out, so we had the whole place to ourselves. It was awesome. I met a buddy of mine that I still, I'm still friends with. We don't talk as much as we used to um, just because of life. Life gets in the way sometimes. He's in another state. He's in uh, Alaska again. Fucker likes cold beer. Bull Mountain, don't go change it. So anyways, he's up there and he's, he's doing his thing. He's uh, opening a restaurant uh, with some people. That's awesome. He's done so much shit. Mike John, like, he's crazy. I love that kid. Anyways, uh, when I met him, skinny kid, shaved head, not like with a razor, but like just short. Bleach blonde hair, always wear white t-shirt. Remind you guys of anybody from the late 90s, early 2000s, even still, but yeah, fucking Slim Shady, right? Eminem, so everyone called him the real Slim Shady. But he was doing that um, before, he was bleaching his hair before Eminem was Eminem. So Wendy and our daughter Ashley went out of town. I forgot what for, they went somewhere and for the night or the weekend. My buddies and I were gonna go drinking. Of course, I'm the only one of age, so we go to this place in Mammoth called Shogun. And it's a, uh, fuck, anyone who's been there knows, but I don't know if they serve sushi or if it's just, I don't remember now, some sort of Asian cuisine in any case. And uh, so my buddies are telling me to order sake bomb. So I don't know what the fuck sake is, so they tell me to order it. So I'll, the guy comes over to the table, the waiter, and I say, a large, large sake, and a large uh, pitcher of Saparu. Saparu is Japanese beer. So he brings it over and the sake is served warm. It's warm rice wine. What, rice wine? Rice wine. And uh, so you do it kind of like an Irish car bomb where you just, you drop it in the, the Saparu and you drink it. I don't know if anyone else does this shit, but you put two chopsticks on top of the glass and then you put your shot glass of uh, sake on top of it. I don't know, we chanted some weird crazy shit and then you'd hit the table, your shot would fall into the Saparu and you'd pound the whole glass. So I did that a couple times. Now keep in mind, before we went there, I also drank two 40s of Old English. That's right. 240s of Old English. We are, well, at least myself and uh, our buddy Murray were pretty toasted. And uh, we're sitting at the table. We order the food. And my, my buddy Murray goes, Hey, uh, John, you want me to show you where the bathroom is, dude? You all right? I'm like, No, nah, no, nah, I'm fucking cool, dude. I'm fine. I'm sitting there. My food comes. I'm just staring at the food. And uh, yeah, where's the fucking bathroom, bro? So we go to the bathroom. He shows me where it's at. I'm in there for what seems like, I don't know, a week and a half throwing up, right? I mean, I'm grabbing this toilet, I'm heaving, my back hurts, my stomach hurts. I thought I'm dying, like I shit a kidney somewhere, I'm pretty sure. It's time to go, and so my buddy Mike and uh, Murray come in the bath. This other douchebag comes in and goes, not other, like my friends were douchebags, but this douchebag comes in <laughs> and starts start talking shit, said something about my mom's grandma or something, I don't know. My buddy says, why don't you watch your own, why, why don't you watch your fucking mouth and mind your own business, all right? Our friend's sick. That's a cool buddy of mine, right? Sticking up for me. The douchebag talking shit, my buddy Murray in the middle, this is from what I was told and this is what I kind of remember. Keep in mind, this is like 15 plus years ago. God, some of you guys watching this aren't even that freaking old. Holy crap. You got douchebag, you got my buddy Murray and he's trying to defuse the situation. You know, man, just go ahead and leave us alone. Our buddy's sick. Mike John just jumps over Murray's back, punches this guy right in the face. Just and hits him, man. Knocks him out, right? Oh, I couldn't have been more thankful. That was kind of, it was cool of him to do that. I wish I could have saw more. I mean, all I saw were six legs moving around the bathroom floor underneath the stall because that's where I was laying. They fall out into the through the doorway into the hallway, and you hear some some girl yell, "Call the police! There's a fight!" Oh shit! So now we got to get up, and we really got to go. So uh, they fight a little bit more. They get up, 
come in the bathroom, pick me up. There's one of them on each arm, on each side of me, right? Come on, Johnny, we gotta go. And my buddies all call me Johnny. Johnny, we gotta go. We can run down, start running down the hall as fast as I could run, drunk like that. And we get to the stairs, right? It's like a like a big. It's not just like a single flight of stairs. It's kind of like those wide stairs, you know, like like in. Um, I don't know, it was like wide fucking stairs. As soon as we get there, for some unknown godly reason, they thought, okay, we'll let go of him now. So they let go of me now, and you will not believe what happened. No, I didn't fall. We w ran down the stairs. I almost fell, though. Uh, we go out into the snow because it is mammoth. It's the middle of winter. And we get in my buddy's truck, right? Mike John takes off. And he's sliding around corners and whatnot, because that's what Mike John does. Corners, this and that, you know, left and right, going around the neighborhood, trying to get me home before the sh uh, police department gets there. And they get me back to my house, put me in bed. One of them brings over a small trash can, like from the bathroom. And my other buddy goes, get that shit out of here. Brings over the kitchen trash can, which was nice, because I went like this, and uh, leaning over it, and I fell asleep on it, right? Oh, it's soccer day. So I'm sleeping on that thing all freaking night. I wake up, dude, my back hurts, my head hurts. Oh my God. Now, keep in mind, my truck is over at my buddy's house and he lives across town. Now, if you guys have been in Mammoth, it's not that big of a town, but it's big enough that, you know, I lived over by, uh, shit, where did I live? Not Canyon Lodge, the other fucking place. Uh, Juniper Springs. So I lived over by Juniper Springs Lodge. They lived over by the high school, so it was kind of a little trick, especially through the snow. I get dressed, and I go downstairs, or go outstairs on the top pad, go to walk down the stairs, right? And as I walk down the stairs, I take my first step, boom, dude, I just slip, hit my ass, and my ass hit every step on the way down the freaking thing. Oh my God, I was laughing, I was in pain, <laughs> but I was laughing, and I looked around, not a damn person saw it, dude. It felt like a wasted shit. So anyways, they came and picked me up, and then we went back and started drinking again. But I almost got my ass kicked in the bathroom, drunk, asaparu, and sake, and being the only one that was of age. It was kind of crazy. So anyways, there's another uh, another story for you guys. All right, so be sure to comment, like, subscribe, share, uh, kick the shit out of that thumbs up button, all right? And uh, we'll talk to you guys later.